The U.S. monkeypox outbreak is now a public health emergency. The White House announcement, meaning federal response, could move quicker with more resources moving to the states. It also requires states to collect data on monkeypox and share that with the CDC. Now, the public health emergency declaration does come as cases across the nation now top 6,000. Dr. Anthony Fauci says more monkeypox vaccine shots are on the way. By the end of the week, we hope to get over 700,000 more vaccines distributed throughout the United States. And I believe that those of us here in Washington will have enough to be able to distribute to the people who need them. Now, those vaccine supplies have fallen short of demand. In Mecklenburg County, the health director says the waiting list for shots has now surpassed 2,000. Tonight, our Verify team fact-checking where the Carolinas stand in priority for vaccine allocations. Verify recently shared how the U.S. strategic national stockpile works and how it contains enough monkeypox vaccine to help millions, but most of those doses are abroad in Denmark. So it has been a bit of a logistics um, challenge. Since the federal government started shipping vaccine back home, state health agencies say more than 11,000 doses have arrived in the Carolinas, with more than 13,000 allocated for the two states to order over the next several weeks. So how is the allocation decided? Well, it's not just about population size. Here are some insights from the CDC, U.S. Department of Health and Human Services, and South Carolina's state epidemiologist, Dr. Linda Bell. 75% is weighted for the disease burden in the jurisdiction, and then 25% for the at-risk population. With most of the allocation determined by disease burden, or how much the virus is impacting the community, it would stand that states with larger case counts would generally get higher priority. The CDC's monkeypox case tracker shows the most cases in New York, California, Illinois, Texas, Florida, and Georgia in that order. And indeed, these are the states with the most vaccine allocations so far. So where do the Carolinas rank in cases? Well, North Carolina is 16th in the nation with 72. South Carolina much further down in the list, 28th in the nation with 23 cases, meaning both states are generally somewhere in the middle when it comes to vaccine priority.